Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hi kids, welcome back to my classroom Can you guess me, where am I? Yes, there's a lot of plants and sounds of animals here And where is it? Yes, you're right, it's in the forest Forest? Are you sure in the forest? Yes, it's in the forest And where is it? Yeah, I'm in Tahura, Taman Hutan Raya Insinyur Juanda Dagoban. Okay, maybe you have so many questions for me, like why I have to be here and then what will I do here? In this video, I'm going to discuss with you about flowering plants. So, why we have to learn about flowering plants? Before we learn about it, I'll tell you two goals of our topic today. First, I hope you can identify the part of plants. Second, I hope you can explain of each part of plants that has different functions. Okay, let's enjoy our classroom today. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tell us from Surah Anamul 60 There is no he better than your God who create the heavens and the earth and sends down for you water from the sky whereby we cause to grow wonderful garden full of beauty and light It's not in your ability to cause the growth of their trees Is there any ilah with Allah? Nay, but they are a people who is cried equal In Tahura, we can find so many kinds of plants and look at around. There's a big tree and there's a lot of plants here. And now I'm going to tell you about part of plants. What are the parts of plants? Okay, now I tell you one by one. First, plants have leaves, stems, and roots. Some have flowers too and each part has a different function look at this plant it's flower and it's a part of plant not all plants bear flowers plants that bear flowers are flowering plants flowers help plants to reproduce and the other function of flowers is help to attract bees and flowers have different shapes size and colors like for this flower the color is yellow and it's small okay let's talk about second part leaves you know there are so many different leaves in each tree there's big small yellow red green and the others leaves have different shapes color edge and texture and what's the function of leaves for plants yes the function of leaves is to make food for plants it helps photosynthesis okay now let's talk third part roots roots hold plants firmly to the ground look at these plants they stand tall even when there's heavy rain or strong wind it's because they are root to the ground trees have different types like these trees have long and thick roots their roots can grow deep into the soil and spread out this holds them firmly to the ground but the other trees such as small weeds have short and thin roots this makes them easy to pull out the other roots can grow in air like orchid plants and the other roots can grow in the water, like water lettuce. But you know, these roots store food and can be eaten. Have you eaten any of them? Yes, the example of roots that store food is radish, carrot, beetroot, and sweet potato. Now let's talk about the last part, stems. Stems join the roots to the other parts of plants. Inside a stem, 
There are many tubes which carry water and mineral salt from the roots to the other parts of the plant. These tubes are water carrying tubes. You know, stems transport water and mineral salt from the roots to the other part of them. And stems also hold the leaves up so that they can get some luck. Some plants have woody stems, but the other plants have non woody stems. For example, woody stem it's like big trees. And the non woody stem it's like cone plants and then flowers. But there are some plants have weak stems. They creep around or climb on the things for support. This helps their leaves get sunlight. For example, morning glory plants climbing up a fence. And the last one, some plants have stems that grow underground. The stems store food. Have you eaten any of them? Yes, for example, of underground stem is yam, ginkgo, water chestnut, and potatoes. Okay, I think it's enough to explore this forest for you. But I have assignment for you. Please make a great mind mapping about part of plants and the function of it. You can use Video Maker, TikTok, or the other aid. Please be creative. Thank you so much. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bye.